and the Lord spoke to me. And he says, I speak not to Canada, say the Spirit of God. I have always had a plan for you. Like I have said of old, I preserved you for me in the, for the end times, and you are now in it. But I bring my word to you, and especially to you, who have sat in darkness and have planned with the enemy to try to resist and even abort my plans. You have thought that I do not care or exist, but I call you to repentance now. You, and even you, in the political class, don't be deceived any longer. My attention is fixed on Canada. And because of that, it is also fixed on you too. My change is coming now. I have given you enough time to correct your ways, but you have continually resisted and have been arrogant against me and my word. You have stayed in darkness and have made laws to hurt my people. Are you their creator? Are you their sustainer? Are you their owner? Where were you when I created them? Where is the written agreement between you and me of where I handed them over to you? My word says, the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof, the world and those that were therein. Now, your sins and arrogance is about to hurt you, except you change your ways immediately. But as for you that have kept my word, and have been continually faithful to me, and have called on my name, and inquired of me, saying, Lord, where is the prophetic word you gave concerning Canada? I say unto you, be still and know that I am the Lord. Is there anything too hard for me? My word never returns to me void of accomplishment. I will yet perform my word concerning Canada. And it is even the end time prophetic destiny. Even now, it has started. And you are already in it, say the Spirit of the Lord. But you have been troubled because of what you have heard and seen around happening. Though it appears that I, the Lord, have been silent, I am not. I have given them time to correct their ways and to turn from their evil ways, but they have not. I will now ask them about their dark and secret doings in the open and in the light. For my light we expose their dark and evil ways for all to see. Be not fretful, be not dismayed. I am with you, say the Spirit of the Lord. I will yet perform my word even as you continue to bring it to me through prayers. My presence is in you. My presence is with you. Now I speak to my body. I speak to my church. Keep my word. Keep my faith. And keep your faith. Contain for it, says the Lord. Use it. And you will see my hand continually at work in your lives. And your affairs. Even from this day, says the Lord. 